welcome back to my channel. It feels so good to be back. I was gone for about a week, week and a half, maybe even two weeks, and it felt like forever. Um, a lot of exciting stuff has been going on in my life lately, and I have just been trying to soak it all in. I have the greatest news ever, and I am finally engaged, and I'm just so, 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 so happy. And I've been running around like crazy trying to plan this beautiful engagement party. And it happened and I'm just, I'm so excited. This is my beautiful, beautiful ring. Oh, is that focusing? There we go. I'm like, I'm ecstatic, I'm smitten. I'm just, I'm so, so, so happy. So happy, so my heart is full. I'm very happy. So anyways, um, to the point of this video, um, I did, or I have been ordering stuff. Um, so I have a lot of stuff to, to show you and share with you and review for you and stuff like that. So I am going to be coming at you more frequently, frequently. And yeah, I did, um, since I have talked to you guys, I did cut my hair. It is short, but not too, too short goes out to right there, but um, it's it's a change. It's a change, but I do have my extensions and I pop them in. I don't know, it just took so much time to do my hair. And I, I mean, I don't mind that. I actually kind of miss it a little bit, but um, this is definitely, I mean, hair always grows back. I'm constantly having roots. So, I mean, it's always gonna grow back. So I know it's, it's totally a nice change that needed to happen and I like it, it's cute. So anyways, I ordered from Tarte and this is the box that it came in and I have not used this just for the sake of the video. I was like, oh, I can't wait to show them this. This is super cute and I know I'm a little, I think it came out just around school when school started and since I did uh, go back to college this semester, I'm just like, I always have to find an excuse to buy cute little makeup. So this is the box that it came in and it came wrapped so really nice, but of course I tore it open because I was so excited to see it. it. It has like a little gold foiled lip kiss on there. And it came very well packaged. It came with a ton of paper. It was stuff like crazy. I'm like, did I order one thing or did I order several? So you always get to choose um, some samples and I just uh, chose the Tarte Tardiest Lip Paint and it's really cute. It comes with enough probably for one uh, one time and that's really cute. I like to, to try different colors like that. I'd rather try it there than to go into Sephora and use the one that literally some people go in there and just use it on their lips So that's a lot more sanitary. So I love that and then I did get the double duty beauty It's the shape tape foundation. I have not tried that. I totally want to try it and then it's the Tarte uh, Tarte shape tape hydrating foundation. So it's just like a little bit of that So I doubt that this is even enough really because it does send you like all of the colors up here and the colors over here. So, I mean, that's really not enough to actually wear it once around and see if you like it. But hey, whatever, that's cute. So, and then, um, yep, then I get just like a little, a little coupon. So, this is super cute. I thought it was a lot bigger when I had seen it online, but I mean, it's super cute and I love the love, love, love the concept of it. It is the blush book for this year. I did not get last year the, the round one with like a whole bunch of them. I think it had like 10 or 12 different shades in there. I snoozed on it and I regret it now. And now if you try to look for it anywhere, it's like skyrocket expensive. So I'm, I went ahead and just got this one. This is super, super, super cute. It looks just like that, that the packaging. It's really, really, really cute. And it has the, the colors on there. My manicure is awful. I got it probably two weeks ago whenever it happened. 
maybe a week and a half ago. And yeah, it's my, my nails are awful now, but anyways, this is the super cute packaging. I am obsessed. It is so, so cute. It literally looks like a composition notebook and I, I love it. I think it's super, super cute. It has this really nice, um, a uh, little metal thing that sticks out right here that says tar. It is so cute and it looks like that. It is glittery, but it won't fall off. It's that like good glitter that they make it look glittery, but they kind of like um, seal it down. So it's not going to fall anywhere, anything like that. But that's what that looks like. This is what the back looks like. And yeah, I think it's so cute. Even on the sides right here, it literally looks like the, the notebook paper. Oh, that is just so, so, so cute. Okay, so I have already opened it, but I haven't swatched or anything. I absolutely love it. It is just the cutest thing. Like it's so cute that I kind of don't wanna use it. I feel like I'm just gonna like put it on my vanity or something, but girl, I'm definitely gonna use it. It looks just like this whenever you open it. It does have, I love that it has this in here. You can rip it out just so it doesn't like, you know, just make a hot mess everywhere. But I love that it has this. I'm gonna leave mine there. Some people take it off, but I'm leaving mine. And then this is what the colors look like. It is so, 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 so pretty. Okay, so I haven't really read up on this. I don't know what it actually comes with. It looks like it comes with a bronzer, and this one looks like it is um, like a really subtle um, highlighter. And then it looks like it comes with one, two, three, four, eight. Yep, it comes with eight blushes. And then the ones in the middle, this one's a, a bronzer, and this one right here is a highlight. That is so, so, so cute. I am loving it. Today I finished my makeup and I have not put on any, any blush today. Just so I could show you guys, I did contour, but I haven't put absolutely any blush on. Um, it, I think I want to try, um, I think I want to go in with Slumber Party and Study Sesh. I will do some swatches for you so you can see like the pigmentation and see, you know. Um, I did, I am using the Morphe Y5 brush. I have been using this one for my blush lately and I've been loving it, it's, a, it's good. So I am going to go in a little bit into Slumber Party. Oh, it looks like it got quite a bit. And then I'm going to go into study sesh up here and then I'll just dust off the excess and put it on. Okay, it's looking good. I just feel like I dipped in there a lot more. Let's go in just a little bit more. Oh. It has a ton of fallout, so it's definitely getting on my brush. Ooh, girl, now I put too much. It's okay, I gotta show you guys what it looks like and the pigmentation. Ooh, I love it. Sometimes I do feel like or I do see a lot of people say that whenever they do come out with with their blush palettes or blush books that they give like a less better quality because there are so many different shades and for one single one, uh, one single blush is $29. And these ones are a tad bit smaller, but they're huge. Like I still feel like they are very big. But um, they do say that it's like less pigmentation and it's not better quality. But just with this, I mean, I think that's beautiful. I think that's br brilliant quality. I do have a favorite from them um, of a blush and I can't think of the name. So I will insert it. 
but um, I think it's gonna be great. I am now going to do some swatches for you guys so you can see how good it is. I'm the type that if it has like some kind of design in inside of inside of it, like I don't even wanna smear it because I feel like I'm gonna mess it up. Get it together, girl. I know I can't be the only one. Ooh, okay. So this one definitely looks like it's, yep. Ooh, it is a highlight. Okay, that's weird. Okay, so I just put it on my arm and you literally cannot even see it. And it's like stuck. Hold on. You know, you can't really tell, but it's like stuck on my finger. Oh, wow. So I literally, it like, it's like, um, like a really thick highlighter. It's, uh, what is it called? It's like the kind of highlighter that, that is like really thick. How do you, it's not powdery. Okay. I don't, I'm just so like everywhere that I don't even know what it's called. But anyways, you guys know what I'm saying. Like, it's really thick. So, yeah, you literally... Oh, my gosh. Wow. Okay, so it's really chunky. I don't know what's going on there. Oh, you can't even see it. But it's right here. And you literally can't even see it. But anyways, the highlighter, I am going to have to try it out and see what I think about it. I didn't even think that there could possibly be a highlighter in here, so I did add highlighter where I usually highlight, and that is on um, just the bridge of my, or not the bridge of my nose, but just right here, and then I put some in my tear duct and a little bit of my cupid's bow, and that's it, that's it. That's all I highlight. I don't like doing it all over over here because you guys already know, my skin ain't perfect, it's very textured, and I don't like anything, putting anything shiny or dewy on my skin that's just gonna accentuate all of the flaws. No, ma'am. Okay, so let's start over here with Spirit Fingers. These are the cutest names, by the way. And let's go in with this, and we're gonna put it right here. Ooh, it's very soft but pigmented, if that makes any sense. This is Spirit Fingers. Wow, somebody needs to tan. And then this one is Raw Raw, which is very peachy. I love it. This one right here, that one's Raw Raw. And then I am going to do, I'm going to skip the bronzer and I am going to go into Slumber Party. And that's the one that I did mix on my skin today. Ooh, that is pretty on its own. Okay, so this, oop, how am I going to, how do people swatch? They make it look so professional. I have not over here make a mess. Okay, so this one right here is the Slumber Party. That's really, really, really nice. So, so far I have Spirit Fingers, Ra Ra, and Slumber Party. So I think that is super pretty. Okay, now I am gonna go in with Pop Quiz. This one is very pinky, very pinky and very vibrant, like this one's gonna be good. Yep, I knew it. You could just tell. Okay, so this one, whoop, that's a little crooked. Um, This one is Pop Quiz right here, and that's exactly what it gives you, a pop, a very nice pop that is beautiful. All right, let's see, let's move on to the other side now. We already did this one, we're doing this one now. Okay, let's go in with Study Sesh. That's the other one that I do have on my cheeks that I mi mixed with Slumber Party. So let's go in with that. Ooh, they're very creamy. Wow, they're like super duper creamy. Ooh. No, these are awesome quality. 
Okay, so this one's study sesh right here. You can see that, that's so, so, so pretty. I really like that one. Next, we are gonna go in with Team Spirit. These ones, I feel like these swatches, you don't literally don't even have to dig in there a lot because the pigmentation is on point. Like this pigmentation is off, awesome. Um, Team Spirit is this one. <laughs> this is really awkward. Okay, this one's Team Spirit. And it is more of a, like a brownie tone. It's this one over here. That's super pretty. I really like that one. I feel like that one I am going to use a lot more, especially now that it's getting cooler. I will definitely lean more towards the darker blushes in this palette, in this blush book. Now this one is L-Y-L-A-S. I do not know what that stands for. I will put it down here so you guys know. Ooh, that one's really pretty. Ooh, I'm so excited. Okay, so this one is the L-Y-L-A-S. Ooh, that's super pretty. Okay, and last but not least, I am going to do Secret Crush. Wow. Ooh, that one's like a Barbie pink. I like that. I even like that for for a, an eyeshadow. I don't like that it's already being really messy. See, that one is Secret Crush. I think that one's really, oops. That one's really, really, really pretty. That's a pretty color, I like that. Um, since it is white all around here, it is. it does have fallout. Just with the swatches, like there's a lot of fallout. But um, this right here, that is the actual notebook paper. It is just like the pack, the outside packaging. It is glittery, see, and it looks really rough there. So it can easily be wiped off if you're like me and like to keep your palettes nice and clean. I'm just very OCD about that, like they have to be clean. So I am now gonna go in with my bronzer and it is in the shade Homecoming. Oh, they are so creamy. Like my finger, like I'll literally dip in there and it'll just sink in there, like it's super creamy. I love that. <coughs> okay. So now right here, this is Homecoming and this is the bronzing shade, the bronzer. I really, 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 really like that. That's a really pretty color. It's really subtle. Um, I don't think that it's dark enough for like a cooler toned girl. Um, I really don't think that that works for them and that is kind of not cool, but I mean, Mm, yeah, you're you're definitely going to have to use a different bronzer for that because this one, it's not very dark. I mean, it might, yeah, it'll be fine for maybe my skin tone, but if you're darker than I am, it won't show. Like it's, it, it's, it's pretty, but it's light, you know, very light to be a bronzer. And then I'm going to do, let's try this. Uh, extra credit which is the highlight one more time because it's driving me crazy that it's not like showing wow I like really dipped in there and did a swatch and you literally cannot see it look at that oh a little bit it's really and then look at the way it stays stuck on my finger do you see that and I will literally like push it down in there and then it's real like blotchy. I don't know. I don't know how I'm going to feel about that highlighter, but we will try it and see what we think. I'm right now using my favorite highlighter from Tarte and also I 
don't remember the name of it. So I will definitely put it down below and put it on the screen so you guys know. Um, that one is very powdery, but nice powdery. It's not like nasty powdery. That makes any sense at all whatsoever. But um, it's my favorite. It's the one I have on in my Cupid's bow and that's the highlight that I like. I pretty much wear it on the daily. Like that one's my favorite. All my other ones are like more, more brownie and stuff like that. So I, I really don't like that one or, or other ones like that. But this one is totally the bomb.com. I think is just super, super cute. It kind of makes me want to purchase another one just because it's just so cute. Like I can't even handle how cute it is. Um, online, it does look like it is going to be a lot bigger, but whenever you get it, like it's a perfect size. I mean, there's so many in here. They spread them out nicely. The names, the packaging, everything is just to die for in this cute little mini blush book. I absolutely love it. And then it is, it's not just, it's, it doesn't just flap shut and then just flaps open and it's not going to make a mess when you're traveling. And I love that. It has this nice magnetic closure and I absolutely love it. Yep. Totally love it. I'm very happy that I purchased this. I'm glad I got a hold of it because it kept selling out and then I'd have to wait for a restock. So I'm so glad I got a hold of it. I think it's $40 or $45. I will list it down below so you can try to get your hands on it. I'm sure it's still available. Since it is limited edition, I do know that it, it if you don't get it like right away, it'll, it'll go away. Like it's limited edition, you know? just like the other one that I regret not getting last year. But I totally love, 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 love the, the blush. I mean, it's just such, such a good value because the regular, um, the regular ones, single ones are 29. So if you put, if you get literally eight blushes in here, one bronzer and a highlight, like, come on, that's just, it's super cute. I mean, this is great for um, somebody that's in college, um, somebody that, any anybody. I mean, e even if I wasn't in school, I would have still bought it. Like, it's super, super perfect, super cute. I absolutely love it. And thank you, Tarte, for coming out with this super cute back-to-school um, little blush book. I'm obsessed. It's super cute, and I am going to be using it every day and I will let you guys know which shades weren't my favorite too much and which ones I enjoy a lot more. I know I'm gonna hit pan probably on study sesh. I just like the darker, cooler tones and out of the more pinker ones, I think I'm gonna use a lot of Spirit Fingers if I want to be subtle and then I'm going to use Secret Crush like this one right here. Super pinky. I mean, I think I'm even going to dip in there for some eyeshadow like I was saying. I'm not kidding. That is super, super pretty. I absolutely love it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will definitely see you guys in my next one. Bye.